little science with Steve Spangler and his young son Jack, who is now taller than me, <laughs> and his voice works. is so much deeper. It is, uh, and Mark and Scotty have joined works. us, and. You know what we're thinking is that New Year's Eve can be a real bust if you're standing there and you're just kind of standing around having to eat hors d'oeuvres and small talk. Do we like small That's talk? So fun. That's not no. fun. No, we hate that. Boring. And we can't say minute to win it because that would be a lawsuit. So what do we call this, guys? <laughs> this is seconds science. in science. Science in seconds. That's or what it is. Science in yeah. seconds. So these are little challenges you can try at home, Kim. Okay. With your enormous dinner parties that you throw all the time. <laughs> this is gonna be a lot of fun. Let's have a party. Mark, show us the first one if you would, because uh, because you have a hair dryer and some ping pong balls. What's the challenge? So I call this one ping pong pop up, and you have to see how many ping pong balls you can get on the uh, okay, go. in Ready? an airstream by the end of one minute. Okay, here we go. Let's float them. Go. Good. Right, that's good. Oh. 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 Come on, you can do it. You can get two. Here we go. So you got a minute to try to get as many as you can. See, this is a great challenge. Isn't it? Stupid I ping love pong it. balls. This is uh, this is good. Oh. 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 At the end of a minute. At the end of a minute, you get to see how uh, it's done. Uh, you get to see how many of them you get, and at the end of the minute, if uh, if you have the most, you're the winner, right? Yeah. I like that because who doesn't like playing with a hair dryer? That's cool. Yeah. Perfect. And some of us have really big dryers, so we could probably do you even can more. Do it, you do it. <laughs> Kim, there's a wine glass next to you. I don't oh, know what that's, that's all so about. Convenient. Hello. <laughs> I could use that right Jack, now. Jack, <laughs> we already bought the ping pong balls. Tell us the next challenge. So this is this challenge is called wine glass wind up, and the object is to get ping pong balls, because you're already invested in them, right. from point A to point B, okay. using only a wine glass. You can't use your hands. Get okay. out. You, and so, scooping them up, that's just cheating, and where's the fun in that, right? No, no, no fun. fun. So, what you have to do is you use the force called centripetal force to move the ping pong, oh, see, it's so silly sometimes. You have to there get the go. ping pong ball up Good. from one point Good. over to the Good. next. Do the next one, next right, one. Ready? And you good. have to go it as fast as you can, get as many ping pong balls as you can in a minute. This is good. Go, go, go. go. Kim, you try you it. Swirl it. Go, hang on to it, hang go. on to it. Nice job. Uh, All right, Kim. I don't know how. Oh, we've got one way to be helpful for you. It is hard, isn't it? You've been it? practicing. The kid has been practicing. That's the problem. See, the problem nice? is it's so silly sometimes. Oh, there you go. Uh, and at the end of a minute, how many of those can you move across? I'm not familiar with using the wine glass. Yours would be every ping pong ball over, then a little swig of the red wine. All right, okay. well, kids, that's a learning yeah, lesson in and of itself, mind. isn't all right. it? All right. <laughs> next challenge, yeah. Scotty. Let's move over. And next challenge, Scotty. Tell us what you have. Scotty, what, what is you yours called? Uh, this is called Mentos Madness. Whammy. And what you have to do is you uh, have to place this yellow ring or a roll of masking tape. Cause that'll work as well. Okay. You have to place that on top of the bottle. Good. And the mento on top of the ring. Good. And you put your... Okay, I'll, oh, help, you. I'll help you. See if you can okay, balance here we go. You it. just tell them what you have to do and so I'll help you with it. you have to stick your finger in the middle of the bottle and then pull it away as fast as you can and make the mento go into okay. the bottle. Okay. Ready, set, go. You can do it. Oh! oh. Yes. Yes. How many of those can you do after a minute? That's a good idea. Kim, we have put a lot of things on the website, but you know what, guys, would be fun? As Kim is telling the people about this, Mom said that this would not be a good idea, but I think that I'll do the Mentos and the Diet Coke, because Kim uh, knows a lot about I've that. Because I've got a lot and of experience your job, with this one. Your job, boys, is when I drop it in, whoever gets the most gets the most amount of money oh, in vending land when yay. we go. You got it? Woo. Kim, tell them about the website. I'll get okay, set up, Okay, you go right? to ninews.com, okay. look for Spangler Science. Remember, oh. kids, practice this safely with the help of an adult, Ready, hopefully. Three, two, one. Pop it in. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Oh, <laughs> Happy New Year. <laughs> I'm out of here. Good job, buddy. Oh, oh, I love the Spangler guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Good job.